Hi, church family. I love a good visual representation, so I wanted to share one with you today. If I take this piece of paper and cut a tiny corner off, it didn't do much damage to the paper as a whole. Now, if I take a paper, fold it up as many times as I can, and cut the same amount off, watch what happens as I unfold the paper. There is so much more damage to the inside than I initially could see. This is a great visual about the power of our words. The things we say can affect not just the outside response of the person who hears them, but may also impact them in a deeper way, either good or bad. Matthew 12, 36 to 37 says, and I tell you this, you must give an account on judgment day for every idle word you speak. The words you say will either acquit you or condemn you. Matthew 12 says you will give an account for every idle word you speak. In other words, the ways you don't think before you speak, or you don't care what you say, or you lash out in frustration. It doesn't say you'll have to account for 50% of the words you speak. Matthew says every word you speak. According to some studies done, the average person speaks about 16,000 words per day. That's a lot of time to say things that are encouraging, impactful, uplifting, versus things that are negative or discouraging or hurtful. Today, use the words God has given you to speak life into people, to encourage someone when they're having a bad day, to smile and welcome the people around you, to congratulate people when they do a great job, to ask people how they are doing and invest in their response. Your words matter.